Hello and welcome back to the channel. In this video we're going to be looking at Ava's second driving lesson. So in this series we're going to be taking Ava through from a complete beginner all the way through her to a test. And in this lesson we're just going to be building on what she learned in the first lesson with moving off and stopping, steering and gears to control the car. And then we'll be introducing junctions and MSPSL for both turning left and right. So be sure to watch all the video to check out my instructor mistake once you've spotted it leave it in the comments maybe you've spotted more than one mistake and be sure to like and subscribe for future content and i'll see you in ava's next driving lesson second lesson so since i last saw you yeah you've gone and passed your theory test yes well done a good you. score you've been out once with your mum yeah twice, twice with your mum yeah since our last little lesson yeah. and what did you go over to on that lesson whereabouts did you go i went up to the tip in the on the end because it's a nice yeah, straight little, road brilliant and like from last time can you think of anything you were like struggling with or have an issue with or free confidence is probably my main one but you know that will come with time um, you were doing very well yeah so we got you moving up and stopping. How did you feel about your gear changes? I was a bit... <laughs> I feel like it's gotten better, but every time I say that when I get in the car with you, she was not well, going to plan. Yeah, so Emma, what did we talk about to make sure you got um, just make sure the that... gear correct? Because well, I think you went from first to fourth. Yeah. Or it was, it was second sticking, it was a bit hard to get yeah, into. Yeah, so you should put pressure on that side of the gear so and put it down. So how would you feel about like, having a practice get, getting moving up and stopping around here because we were here last time yeah and um yeah how confident would you feel it starting up go around the block starting stopping or do you want a bit of guidance how would you feel a little bit of guidance a little bit of guidance, guidance. Right. Give a good go. how about if i if you forget something how about i prompt you and yeah. give you a bit of a, a reminder yeah of what to do brilliant good all right so do you want to do you want to do then do you want to get Ooh. us moving off? Yeah. And I'll prompt if you've forgotten anything or you want to help. Okay. Or if anything unusual happens, if you come in, there's some hazard around the corner, I can help you with that. Mm -hmm. Yeah? Happy? All right. So, what do you do? Once you've done your cockpit drill, mm -hmm. what do you do next? Pom. Very good. Mm -hmm. Well, before you do pom, you'd need to get the engine started. So, there was a couple of safety checks involved before you start the engine. Make sure the handbrake's on. Very good. It's in neutral. Yeah, don't trust me. I could have left it in third when I drove it. Here. Not good enough. No, it's in neutral. Very good. Um, wait. All right, so if you're happy, you start her up. Have you given the new car a name? I know a lot of people do. Have you gone down that road? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, all right, going on. To what is her name? Roxy Red. Roxy Red. Roxy Red, that's okay. her name. Yeah. All right, I'll remember that. So, um, all right, Roxy Red, let's do it. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. Hang on. Yeah, you, in your time, you just relax if you're not sure of anything to start. Remember, Mo can always come in and help you, but I haven't got your controls, as you know. Yeah, yeah, yeah that's that scary. Car. So, I will give you instruction if there was a problem. Okay. So, you put it in first. Preparing, we'll find the bike. No. Yeah, where should your right foot be? In the accelerator. Yeah, and why do you need it there? Um, so you can put some gas. A little bit of power. <laughs> yeah, it might struggle to get off. Good. What well I'm checking again. Job. Well done. Nice and smooth, isn't it? And I'll leave it up to you if you want to go for a second before the bend or you can just stay as you are if you just want to set it in. Just going to be there just to bring you away. No, you already don't have to apologise, I'm just here to help you. That's one of my best what I do, a little bit of it. Then once we get 
get around the corner. Did you want to practice coming to a stop just to make sure you can bring it to a nice stop near the curb? Yeah. All right. So when we get around the corner, if you find somewhere that's safe to pull up on the left. So that was brilliant. So anything there that you would make do any differently, improve upon, or um, was that pretty perfect? It was okay. I just need to. I I know I need to stop looking down. It's just hard not to look down at the gears when you're trying. Yeah. So when you went for that gear yeah. change, where because we just moved to the left yeah, a little I know. bit there, is that because are you sort of looking? I'm just saying I'm going to put it in full off again. I don't want that to. You're happen. worried about putting it. Yeah. <laughs> And so, because your gear, second gear is quite stiff, yeah. so we'll go just just shove it over to the left and then put it back and that will pop into the gear. Yeah. Meanwhile, it's quite a common mistake, as you take one hand off the wheel, like if you're holding the wheel a bit tight, the right because the right arm's tight, it can sort of push, yeah. so it can push you over. So you do, what would you need to do? Just, relax, don't be so stressed. <sighs> Relax your shoulders and just hold it nice um, and light. When you slow down, do you put it back in first? No, you can just stop in second. Okay. You can stop in any gear. If you were going to move up again, then you get, get in the gear in. that you want to okay. get going in. Um, so, you, no, you don't need to put it in first before you stop. You can just stop. That's very good. Now, before we pulled in, you checked your mirrors. Can you remember which ones you checked before we signalled? You did check that one. Yeah, I did a little. Did you check that one? Yeah. Did you check that one? Yeah. Oh, I, 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 okay. <laughs> oh, I missed that one then. It's a bit too quick, I missed probably. that one. So, just, do you know why we do check that one? That's pedestrian. You're more like a cyclist. What, on that side? Well, I think. Oh, if, yeah, because they're going to come. Think if you're you know, driving in the town, they'll be up the left. Them little scooters. They might whip up there. Yeah. So just have a little look before you put the signal on. And that was, that's brilliant. Nice stop, handbrake neutral. Remember that? Mm. Lovely. And just put your hands, once we get round the corner, then we'll get you to put your hand on the gear stick just to practice, just being light okay. with the steering. We'll do that. Happy? Mm -hmm. Great. When you're ready, drive on. Try again just to help you relax the other arm. So just rest it there and just speak right. Here. Does that feel more relaxed? Yeah. That's how you want to try and be mid gear changed. So, what we do at the end of the road, we go left by leaving it first. And has anyone bothered us? No. So, if we see no one coming around this corner, put your hand on the gear stick. So, you can steer one hand. You would just go for a nice gear change. Take your time, but don't rush out. Just been prepared in case we meet someone here, so you're already covering the clutch. If you met someone, what would you do? Because the roads are a bit narrow. Just have the brakes. <laughs> yeah, just bring in the brakes. You could also put the clutch down if you thought you need to go like very slow, like a second before you're around there a bit quick. So you could always roll the clutch in and just finish a few brakes if you need to see. Leave it in seconds. If we do mirror signal first, bring in your brakes, put your clutch down, steer a little bit with your clutch down, and just come to a stop. And then once you've stopped, if you just put a handbrake on for a sec, then you can get that first gear. Oh, I'll in. You want to be <laughs> <Stem>. <laughs> You're, you're wet. Sorry. <laughs> So you got your first gear, don't apologise, I'm just not keeping up with you. <laughs> so um, so you got your first gear, got your foot on the brake, mm -hmm. so because you got that on, would we roll back? No. So where could you put your right foot now? On the accelerator. You could. And then what would you need to do with your left foot uh, so we don't roll back? Find the bike point. Find the bike point. 
and then once you've got that mic when you hold the handbrake and then you can do your look in and if it's safe because you've got the bike when your handbrake goes off you shouldn't roll back you can try that well don't try it no, now no, no. just shoot forwards so once this car turns and there's no one behind us is there so if you slowly release your handbrake the car should just balance because you've got the mic point there so yeah, and I'm a tiny bit of gas just to push up the lovely picture and then think about a second just ease off the gas take your time with the gear that's it it's going to time to get in much better these gear trees are in lovely now and then we'll take the next lap but this time if you do your mirror signal a bit earlier then use a bit of brakes so just press your brakes there the straight line Come off your brakes and turn. Just feel the difference. Oh, yeah. Kind of, it feels a bit more controlled than it. Just because you just last time it went a little bit quick, we could just take a bit of speed off before the bend, and so then it go in lovely, lovely. Good, 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 good. Go around again. <laughs> tell me if you're getting bored, or on the other side of the coin, tell me if you're getting a bit overloaded. You know when we go to the end of the road, you yeah. you're you asking me about the first gear, like when you go in. Yeah. What we could try and do is time it so we're in first gear, give you time to look, and if it's clear we can carry on in first. Yeah. But we don't want to go first too early. So can I talk you through like how you do that again for this one? So we're going to go left at the end. You're in second gear, mm -hmm. so as you come out to it, the first thing to do would be check your mirrors, see what's going on about there, aren't you? Mm -hmm. And then we'd put the signal on. And then you'd be easing off the gas pedal, yeah. covering the clutch, which you are. You'd be bringing the brakes in a little bit, clutch down and into first. Up to the bike and steer, and just keep your feet on the bike covering your brake in case you need it. Yeah, so if you didn't need it, you can carry on, but if you want to have a good old look, just be close down a little bit more. That's it. Put your handbrake on, so then we won't roll back. You can leave it in gear for now. Put the handbrake on first, then you won't roll. Yank that on. That's it. Good. So now the car is secure. There's no one behind, so you go relax. You don't, you know, no panic. We're good. So if you put the clutch down now, because it's in gear, this is where the car would have rolled back. So that's probably their handbrake first. So you can't roll anywhere. So now you've you've got your clutch down. You can take it out of gear. And you can take it for a break. Oh, your car just did that by itself. It's automatic start stop. Yeah. That's, that's right. Yes. So um so now if you prepare yourself again, just gather your sort of compose yourself. Get back into first and do your palm routine. Good sweetie. Very good. And what you need a little bit to give you a bit of power to yeah. get out there. Yeah, just a tiny bit. That's mm. it. Just as Don't worry. So what did you do? You still, mm -hmm. let's say there was a car behind. That's it, handbrake goes on. Clutch goes down, it might restart. Right. You can, you can leave it in gear, just so you clutch down. If it restarts, then you'd be in first gear ready. You've got to take my foot off the gear when I... Yeah. <laughs> 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 got it. So yeah, so oh, if you go back to... So, is there anyone behind? Yeah. No, so don't stress, you're all right. That's why we're in a nice quiet area. And if they was, they could just go round. <laughs> or I could help you. Mm. So, do you want me to help you or do you want to give it a go? It helps them. So, if you put it pretty close down, into first, and just get that bite so you can feel it. A little bit lower. Hand on the air brake. And you're covering the gas. So now, 
what we want to try and do is to see if you can release the handbrake and keep the car still. We don't want to go over the line yet. So see if you can release the handbrake and get the, the bite between there. Look, perfect. Now, to fill in control. Now you can put a little bit of curse on. And then it would say a little bit more gets to sweep you out right there. And then if it's setting, how would it help him in slow or anything the catch up? And where would you go? Just on. So I live. So if you're still bursting at the don't panic, put your handbrake on, then you can't knock back. And just ease off the gas. Hit clutch down into first, we'll let the car roll, we're not going to stop, up to the bite, and there, and now we're just going to use clutch control to keep creep towards the junction. So as the curb curves away, steer, dip your clutch to the bite, and see if you can balance the car there, and if it's clear... No, 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 no. Okay, it's alright. So now you've stopped, okay. car's stalled. I couldn't feel the clutch. The fight. It's alright. I couldn't feel it. So no one behind? No. Take your time. So what would you do once you've stalled just to get to see you now you're not going to roll anywhere? Magic. Great. I see, I see now. You have you, to lift yeah. it straight off the cloud. Yeah. Like some, some cars will start. Mm -hmm. yeah. So it obviously wants you to go handbrake and neutral. <laughs> Okay, so we're just composed Yeah, I know, I can see the heart and the, I'm sorry. I've said sorry. You're, you well, you're not, don't need to be sorry. You're doing a good job. Do you feel a bit, like, stressed? You're doing fine, honestly. You all right? You're doing fine. Just relax. Do you, you want to give you, do you want a break? I, if I had dual controls, I'd offer to help you, but I haven't. By myself. <laughs> <laughs> See, so um, yeah, I talk with free. So if you get your bite, perfect. You can you take your foot away from the brake. You can just cover that gas, and then if it's safe, keep your feet still and slowly release the handbrake. There we go. Lovely. Well done. Good. When we get into our little side road, do you want to put up a little break? Yeah. So you're going out with your mum when she finishes work. So it's still light, I'm guessing. It's light, it's about half nine, isn't it? At the minute. Yeah. Good. So, whenever you make a mistake, don't worry about it. But you, you could, that's all part of making mistakes, mm. isn't it? What was your mistake? What what happens? No, she couldn't find the bite. There's no. like nothing there. You, as you, you got into first, and then you come up to the bite, mm. and if it's clear, you could keep your feet with it and roll out. You wasn't sure, you wanted to have a good look, so you just put your foot on the brake, mm. and the, you, you were still on the bite, so the car stalled. So what would you do differently if you do want to stop with the clutch? What would you need to do with that to prevent the stall? Just roll in. Just put it down. Push it down. Attach the brakes and then you roll. But the most important thing is you stopped. Me? <laughs> because yeah, I've got out in the road even more. If, don't worry, I'd be on that. I'd, I'd, I wouldn't, if I've already looked, well good, I wouldn't let you out everyone's safe, honestly. My job is health and safety. I'll keep you safe. Mm. Yeah. Because all you wanted to be able to do is learn, make your mistakes. Because you've got to make mistakes. Do you, I take it you, you don't like making mistakes? No. You're going to make mistakes. How are you going to learn if you don't make a mistake? So, um, So don't worry about that at all. <laughs> What about if we stay on this little estate mm -hmm. and just go around a different block? There's a different block on it? I know what we could do. We could go around here, around the corner, take the first left mm -hmm. and at the end of that road turn right and come the other way around, like just 
start to do some right turns. We've done going around left. Mm -hmm. Try some rights on this little block that you're familiar with. Because once you've done that, that'll open up your weld. You know, you can go more. I know you, I'm not doubting you couldn't turn right. <laughs> but if we have a go on a quiet road, then we see where we are. Mm -hmm. Should give it a go? Yeah. Let's do it. That's on me, that one. Well, we yeah, I'm the one that's driving it. But I should have noticed it. My, what's my job? Keep <laughs> safe. Your job's to learn. That's the, your only job to learn stuff. Make mistakes and learn. That's what you've got to do. Yeah. So, what we do, take the next road on the right. It's a demerit. View signal. Just touch your brakes just a tiny bit and just position just left of the centre. It's hard to judge because there's no line. Just gonna put you there, clutch down, roll your clutch in there, and now roll off the brakes, look in, check your mirror, and if it's safe for steering. Very good, strap your wheel, and then you bring that clutch back. Love. Good. So we'll come to a stop at this one, so do your mirrors and signal. We'll cover the brake. Are you going left or right? Sorry. I'm going to go right. Clutch goes down into first. Okay. And roll right up to the line and then just dab the brakes at the ends. Alright, good. Now, can you see to the left? Is no, what's no, your view like? Combo. They're having a conversation. So, but what should be like to the left? Could you creep forward a bit or lean no, a bit I can, more? Yeah. So get the bite. I'd put, see me, I'd have my hand to the right so I can give it a good old, big old steer mm -hmm. when you want to go. Have another check and you're happy it's safe? Yeah. Okay, so then you can release the foot brake and roll gently off the clutch. Are you where you got the blue one behind you? So you didn't panic, good. And the white one too. And I just, yeah, the signals cancel itself. 